at this series, it is the series made of all odd numbers starting from 1. I've shared this in one of my previous videos where the sum of odd numbers is always equal to the square of the number of terms you're taking. So in this case, we don't know how many terms we are taking, but the sum here has to be equal to the square of some value always, okay? So just like you can check, 1 plus 3 is 4 because I've taken two numbers, 4 is a square of 2. Similarly, if I take 1, 3 and 5, the sum is 9, which is the square of 3. So the pattern follows. And now look at the sum given to you. This has to resemble some square number. Now without a calculator, if you have to analyze the pattern here, this is possible only when you're squaring numbers where 1 is only present. 1 square is 1. 11 square is 121. The square of 111 is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. If you'll keep going on like this, then you will see that whatever number of 1's you have, you'll go ahead and write down the numbers in series 1, 2, 3, 4 and then take the mirror image of that. Okay, so logically the middle value here resembles the number of 1's you have taken. So if I'll go back to the question and see, the middle number here is 9 because on the left and right what I have is just the mirror image. So it is very clear that 9 digits must be there or this number resembles the square of the number formed by 9 1 so therefore the answer has to be option D where there are exactly 9 1 okay so these are the two important properties I used solving this question I hope it made sense